I'm Paul Cook and in this Lab Life video we're going to look at melting point apparatus. Uh, we've used it recently for an A-level chemistry required practical um, and they're looking at the synthesis of aspirin and we're going to test the purity of the substance that they've produced by using this melting point apparatus. Now aspirin has a melting point of 135 degrees Celsius. We need to set our plateau temperature and what we've done is we've set it just below the 135 degrees C. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch the unit on and we've got our light on our viewfinder here and we can see that we're starting off quite low and it's going to take a little while uh, for our temperature to rise. So we've got some buttons here. So we hold down our plateau temperature and we increase it. hold it now we can quickly go up and if we go to 125 we we'll leave ourselves 10 degrees to our expected melting point now hopefully our unit will start heating up quite quickly to our 125 degree plateau temperature So in the meantime, while it's warming up, I can show you, we've already got the unit up on its uh, feet here so that you can change the angle of the unit. And then when we're going to use our capillary tube, we're going to put them in here, and slide them through. And if you can see that there are two slots, so there are two troughs that you can use and then we can view them uh, through this magnified uh, viewfinder here. So we've got our test sample that the students have already produced and in here are our capillary tubes. On. And as you can see, it takes a little while for the unit to heat up. Okay, so now we've reached our plateau uh, temperature, what we need to do is gain our sample tap off the excess put it in, into the side in here if I insert it through I can see the crystals through the viewfinder at the moment so we can see that it's still a solid now you can see here that we've got our indicator to show that we've got our plateau temperature reached and what I'm going to do I'm going to press this button to start 
temperature ramping. So it's going to go up in increments of two degrees. So if I press start now, you can see that it's now ramping. Now what you would do is you would observe the capillary tube for it to show signs that it's beginning to, to melt the sublime. So you notice that from the outside edges uh, the substance should begin to liquefy. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to move it now so that I can I can observe it and remember that what we're looking for is a temperature of 135 degrees Celsius. That's if it's really pure. So the temperature is slowly increasing. So we're now 129 degrees Celsius, 130, 28 meter. So I can still see that it's a solid. And just see that it's beginning to go. Thirty-five, it's gone. So you can say that the sample that the students made is very, very pure. We've got an excellent result from our A-level students.